Okay, the world feels like it's gone mad. The Omicron virus is exploding. Um, I like to refer to it as the Franken virus because it's mutating and no one knows what it's doing. And the world just feels like it's such a wild, crazy ride at the moment, just when we felt like we were getting back to normality. I've been pondering how I go into 2022 with a different lens compared to how I've been go I went into 2021. Uh, because I think 2022 is pretty much going to be a bit of a ride. Um, at the moment, I'm trying to plan a holiday in January um, with some friends who are meant to be coming out from Amsterdam. I don't know if it's going to happen, if regulations will be put in place, if lockdowns, if red lists, all of those kind of things. So it's really difficult to plan for 2022. And then as a business person, we often want to plan. We often want to forecast. We want to see how we can grow our business, whether it be 10% per month or double our revenue, whatever it is. But it makes for such uncertain times to be able to forecast and to be able to predict how our business is going to unfold over 2022. So I've decided not to set goals for next year. I've decided to set intentions. I have a one-line business plan, and that's to make people better. That's my intention for next year is I want to make people better through my training, through my coaching, through my speaking, and in the interactions I have with them. And I want to make money, but money is a consequence of my intention, not the, not the actual direction that I'm going to go on. Because if I don't necessarily hit my goals and my targets for next year. If I manage to sustain my intention, the year has been successful. Goals can be re-articulated. Goals can be changed. Intentions don't have an end date. I really want to challenge you to look at what is your intention for 2022? What do you want your business to look like? What do you want you personally to look like? How are you going to show up in the world in 2022? What is going to be what you leave behind? Like I said, I want to make people better. I hope that when people watch a little video that I've put on, that they walk away feeling a little bit better and, and a little bit more energized to face the day. So I recommend that that's what you focus on. Don't worry too much about goals. Um, they are important. I make my living of people setting goals. But I think really spend December looking at what your intention is. What are you? How do you want to show up in 2022? And let your, goal, your goals unfold from your intentions first. Uh, have a great December, everybody.